Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. We are back inside of AnyType because AnyType have, has a few quality of life improvements which I'm going to talk about in this video and the first one is probably my favorite. This is something I've been waiting for for a long time time so i will explain uh, all of the quality of life improvements and in some of them i will also actually show you how i feel like this is benefiting me personally and use cases for these quality of life improvements let's just start off with the first one and uh, another thing just to have that mentioned i won't cover everything i will link the re release notes down below but i will only cover the major things in this video so first thing we can now actually uh, edit relations on multiple things like this so i could change if this these were for my clothing brand and not for my personal social media i could change that or if all of them are done, I can actually change them from right here. Save, okay, and all of them should now be done as they are right here. Uh, so this is a really uh, cool new quality of life improvement. I can see here now that I need to fix the filter on this as well. Uh, but that is something I will do in another video because I have it uh, right now that if it's done uh, here, it won't actually disappear. I actually have to click this. I don't know why, but I will fix that later. Um, but the way this works and the way I probably will be using this is for quick capturing. So one of the things that I think any type is terrible at, uh, and there is no such thing as a perfect application. So uh, all applications have something they are not good at, and any types thing is actually quick capturing. Uh, but this makes it a little bit easier but because before when you would quick capture, so I have an inbox page right here so I can capture things on the go and when I'm on the computer quite quickly. Uh, so just to show you an example, let's say, let's call this any type new release. I can't actually spell the release so we will just do our best. Uh, this is, um, let's just call it. Uh, any type new release press enter and now it is inside of here as well uh, inside of my all view and instead of going one by one whenever I've captured a lot of different things I can now actually go uh, in and edit multiple at the same time which is uh, something that I've been waiting for for a long time. This makes it a lot easier for me to capture a lot of things and then uh, get back to them and uh, actually organize them later. Uh, so that's why uh, what I will personally be using this for is actually being able to um, capture a lot of things and then more easily be able to uh, organize them and give them the right uh, relations because inside of this uh, set right here I uh, I use the relations to have things organized so basically like properties and uh, that's why this is such a great uh, new quality of life improvement so the next uh, thing I wanted to show you is that uh, search is now actually uh, improved. Search inside of something like any type is really important because you will end up having huge amounts of information uh, inside of uh, inside of any type. Uh, but there are a couple of things that are now added. So search now highlights, it shows more total results. Uh, it allows you, uh, allows searching for text relations, blocks, tags, statuses, and links and backlinks. One of the things I struggled with is that it wouldn't, um, it wouldn't actually uh, search for my tags. 
So this is actually a huge improvement. Search is really important inside of productivity and note-taking applications. So this is a huge improvement. Let's see if I can find some place where I have a lot of notes here. So let's make this full screen so you can see it. And let's search inside of here. Uh, and let's search for pride. Um, it now highlights sets. So this is also good for long form writing if that is something you are doing inside of your AnyType to easily be able to find things. I use this a lot in PDFs uh, and uh, websites mainly uh, where I do control F and search for specific things. Now you can do that inside of AnyType as well using the search inside of this document. So that is also another cool feature. Um, and the next thing I wanted to show you is actually uh, that you now can reuse files. So let's just start by uploading a file. I don't think I have any files here. Let's try this. Uh, and now this is uploaded and you can quite easily reuse the file. So what I will have to do is backslash then file uh, and then right clicking will actually give me the ability to reuse an existing file. And I actually have a bunch of files right here. So I can reuse one of them. Let's try this one. Uh, and that's basically how uh, you can use this reuse uh, files, uh, reuse files feature, quality of life improvement. Uh, and this is great. So you don't actually have to re-upload uh, files multiple times, just a easy quality of life improvement, which makes the, uh, makes the, um, makes the app a lot better. Uh, we, also have a couple of more things that I just want to mention, but I won't go too uh, much into these. Actually, I will go into one of them if I jump back here uh, and I jump into my uh, any type types. You can now actually sort these by name or newest created or recently used. Again, a uh, great. Um, quality of life improvement. As you start building out your any type space, these can become uh, huge. Uh, your types, your type library can become huge and having a better way to organize them is great. Uh, so you can find what you're looking for. We also have a test, uh, text justification, new options to justify text in blocks for better formatting. Um, and we also have link blocks. So uh, default link style has been changed to car and you can personalize this inside of your settings. So you can go to your preferences and you can actually uh, find um, where it says link to object style and you can change that as well. So a lot of quality of life improvements we have a lot of bug fixes as well uh, and any type is continuously getting better and better uh, and again many of these improvements might not seem huge but they actually make a huge difference when you are using the app every single day as usual if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below and i will try to get to them as soon as i can and let me know which one of these were actually your favorite new feature?